For my issues in instructional technology class, I am extremely happy to be able to use one of my favorite apps to talk about two of my other favorite media apps for instructional technology. I'm using TouchCast app, one of my favorite media apps for production purposes and creation, to be able to bring to you today my tech tip, which is how we take media apps and use them for not only professional learning, but also connecting professional learning and using those apps for students to be able to use in our classrooms for global outreach learning projects. So today we're going to talk about two apps that I feel are very, very efficient in being able to communicate and help us to communicate professionally as well as work with our students to do the same. The first one we're going to talk about is Voxer. It is a instant voice messaging app. It allows you to use voice, text, and photo images. It is a free download and it is able to be downloaded on both iOS and Android. I also believe that apps that are device agnostic that do not um, specifically just work with one or the other are very favorable in education. The reality of Voxer for me is that you have a live listen which means you're able to listen immediately or you're able to listen later because we do not all have the same professional learning times the professional learning schedules nor are students always in the same classes or in the same time zones as people that they're learning with this ability to listen later to me is incredibly important. I would encourage you to explore Voxer, and I'll explain a little bit later how Voxer changes how I use professional learning and how it could also work for you. The second one that I'm going to talk about is Glide. Glide allows you to text and record video up to 1 minute and 30 seconds. Now, the key differences between these apps is that for a free account with Voxer, you can have up to six people in one Vox, which means you can be collaborating with up to six people or six classrooms at any one time. Glide gives you a whole lot more opportunity to add classrooms or professionals that you are communicating with. Um, Voxer does not have a limit per se that I have found on time, whereas Glide does limit each snippet to a minute and 30 seconds. Depending on what it is you're looking for, perhaps that one minute and 30 second short snippet is going to be far more effective for your professional learning. I love Glide for the same reasons device agnostic. You can find Glide on both Android and iOS. And the reality is that it is wonderful because these messages are not saved on your phone. They are saved in the cloud, which means you are not using space. Yes, you are using data, but you are not using space. So I want you to think about Glide and Voxer, both of which that are dev device agnostic, that could be used to communicate. One of my great friends, Amber Tiemann, who is an administrator in Texas, wrote a Vox, um, Voxer blog recently, and I loved it. I loved it because Amber hit on some major points that I completely and totally agreed with. Though Amber and I at the time were not sharing ideas on Voxer, what it allowed me to do was add Amber and realize that she can be yet another person that I can be talking to about professional learning opportunities. If you're unaware um, of what an EdCamp is, an EdCamp is a professional learning opportunity that is led by and designed by educators. There's no plan. There's no agenda. It is all about what you want to learn, who you want to learn from, and where you want to learn it. So Amber actually wrote this blog on Voxer being this EdCamp that she essentially had on her phone because she was illustrating how she was able to connect with people across the country who were able to provide her really great professional learning opportunities and build within her things that she had before only seen as an opportunity to do when she was actually attending events. So after Amber's, I said I wanted to do the same. So I actually wrote a blog as well. So you can actually go and find this blog. Um, it's titled, um, the blog is called Breaking Down the Walls of the Classroom. But it's about these two social media apps that change the face of how we learn. So I'm able to learn with professionals around the globe. Students are able to learn with classrooms around the globe. And without a doubt, this is in fact ways media apps can change the way we communicate, collaborate, and focus. So I encourage you to download either Voxer or Glide or both. Find me if you'd like. I would love to be able to communicate and collaborate with you, but I would love to challenge your thinking and making you see this idea of, of media apps as a fabulous means to build us professionally and build our students in collaboration and communication.